Reserve's body crumbled alongside existentialism. But why? A few more seconds, without change, no other gray serpent appeared. It's really over. Although she believed buying time was in her favor, she never once imagined her victory would come so sudden and absurdly. I don't know in which future gray serpents will be reborn, but I'm sure it won't disappoint them. Yes, I foresaw the infighting of gray serpents and gave one party a sugar-coated bullet, literally, in order to bring it forward. I just want you to understand humans more, and also to understand yourself more. That's not much to ask, right? She threw something towards Gray Serpent, who subconsciously dashed it. The candy returned to electric discharge and Hankai energy as it flew to Gray Serpent and disappeared by his side. At the same time, a feeling similar to a neuron electrical impulse flashed through his central controller. Just sharing a candy the friends gave me. Because their dreams are a construct of imaginary space, I can feel what they feel this way. Sweet, isn't it? Gray Serpent felt a little dis uncomfortable. He suddenly began to suspect if conversing with this outsider would really be productive. Regardless, she seemed more whimsical and unpredictable than he had expected. Yet she did not notice his silence. She turned another candy into electrical arc in her hand, and smiled joyfully. Ah, tasty! <laughs> But the friend who gave me this candy said that in dreams, candies have no taste and games aren't fun either. After that, she fell into another child's dream with a bam. Probably because she did not merely want candy itself, but the moment she gets the candy, or the moment she shares the candy with someone else. But rest assured, I really did nothing to their dreams. But those dreams are too fragile. Even the slightest shock would break them. It's the husk born of human dreams. As long as human dreams in the Sigma space last, it can never be destroyed. Human beings can never give up sweet dreams, no matter how vulnerable they are. Understood. You chose to fight against humanity's instinctive choice. Humanity's choice. More like mobs to me. Gray servant has gone silent. They're killing themselves. Although it's unnecessary, it doesn't stop the world serpent from bestowing a form of care on humans. You mean those never-ending dreams? Vast is the power of origin. All things owe to it their beginning, and it nurtures all in the universe. To them, those dreams are their entire world, their universe. The dreams here originate from humanity's authentic memories. If not for external influences, they will be an ideal, flawless heaven. I remember a colleague who always said, "Humans only believe in what they wish to believe in."
So, compared to watching everything crumble as you sink into endless solitude in unavoidable death, wouldn't it be better to welcome eternity in an ideal and mystical manner? It's more human, isn't it? No, not you. Not you people. It's you. Gray serpent's limbs suddenly began to twist and spasm. If he was a human, it could be regarded as a neurosis. Yet his shiny metal body turned it into an absurd and uncanny scene. So it was a previous access. I was tricked by wars for pacifying children. <laughs> I, is my consciousness merging with the sigma space? You definitely understand humans, but you don't seem to understand emulation. The stigma space gathers all humanity's consciousness and knowledge, and this means any existence, even one as strange as you, can be captured by Project Stigma as long as you have a consciousness similar to that of a human. So this is why you've been arguing with me about the truth to buy time for this capture. Why else would I bother discussing the previous humans with you? Truthfully speaking, they could walk on their hands. I would be surprised. While you were racking your brains to speak for humans, all your words have made you a perfect target for Project Stigma. A foreign anomaly. So what? Under Project Stigma's influence, nothing can overcome Sire's will. Regardless if it's you or finality, in fact, even Sire himself, we're more advanced life forms. Humans must learn from us to evolve properly. Preposterous! Who do you think you can liberate? Foolish, beyond saving. The enforcer that keeps the world running never had a childhood. Gray serpent's metal limbs flailed for a few more seconds before jerking into a complete stop.